Let's look at the word common. Do you think you are common? Let's explore the word and see if we are or who is. We think common is something in everyday life. We are used to it. On the internet, it is occurring, occurring, found, or done often. Prevalent, use, usual, ordinary, familiar, regular, frequent, recurrent, everyday. In an everyday occurrence, we sin. So we as common people sin. What does God's word say about that? Leviticus 4, 27 through 28. And if any one of the common people sin through ignorance, while he doeth somewhat against any of the commandments of the Lord concerning things which ought not be done and be guilty, or if his sin which he has sinned comes to his knowledge, then he shall bring of his offering a kid of the goat, a female without blemish, for his sin which he has sinned. <coughs> the Jews see us as common people today, cattle. In the dictionary, it is belonging equally to or shared by all. I can see this we all sin and we die. Number 16 and 29. If these men die the com common death of all men, or if they be visited after the visitation of all men, then the Lord hath not sent me. <clears throat> this verse says a lot, believe it or not. Most people die, or most people don't die old anymore. We die of cancer, liver, colon, skin, breast, all types. Do you see where this is going? I don't see the word of God common, but it needs to be for all. In the temple, there is hollowed bread. 1 Samuel 21, 4 through 5. <clears throat> and the priest answered David and said, There is no common bread under my hand, but there is hollowed bread. If the young men have kept themselves at least from women. And David answered the priest and said unto him, Of a truth, women have been kept from us about three days. Since I came out, and the vessels of the young men are holy, and the bread is in a manner common, yea, though it were sanctified this day in the vessels. <clears throat> we know of a church being called a woman, an adultery against Creator God. When the bread is eaten, to be, and it became common. David understood the way of Creator God. So let's look at this way. We have common ways of Creator God and Satan. We can see this in life, blessing and cursing. The cursing is evil. Ecclesiastics 6. And we want 1 and 2. There is an evil which have been under the sun. And it is common in a man, a man whom God hath given riches, wealth, and honor, so that he wanteth nothing for his soul of all the desire. Yet God giveth him not power to eat thereof, but a stranger eateth it. This is vanity, and it is an evil disease. Cancer is a disease, and we is common but not sin, life on this earth, vanity. But it is common, and there is common people. Then there are the uncommon. So I can see back in the old times, people see themselves as uncommon, if they are wealthy or in the monarch. And when you had a special grave, 
So let's go to Jeremiah 26 and 23. And they fetched forth Uriah out of Egypt and brought him to Jehoiakim the king, who slew him with a sword and cast his dead body in the grave of the common people. I see myself as common. I am no better than you, no matter who you are. We are all common in this earth. Even our food is common. Jeremiah 31 and 5. Thou shalt plant vines upon the mountain of Samaria. The plants shall plant, the planters shall plant, and shall eat them as common things. The people God gave the honor to be his people believe they are uncommon, that they are common too. Ezekiel 23. And we want four, uh, 38 to 46. Moreover, this they have done unto me. They have defiled my sanctuary in the same day and have profaned my Sabbath. For when they had slain their children to the idols, then they came the same day into my sanctuary to profane it. And lo, thus have they done in the midst of my house. And furthermore, that ye have sent four men to come from far, unto whom a messenger was sent. And lo, they came for whom thou didst wash thyself, painest thy eyes, and decketh thyself with ornaments, and setteth upon a sultry bed, and a table prepared before it. Whereupon thou hast set my increase and my oil, a, and a voice of the multitude, being at ease with her and with the men of the common sort, were bought Sadhenians from the wilderness, which put bracelets upon their hands and a beautiful crown upon their head. Then said I unto her that was old in adultery, Will they now commit whoredom with her and she with them? Yet they went in unto her, and as they go in unto a woman that playeth the harlot, so went they unto a hola and unto a halaba, the lawy woman, the righteous man. They shall judge them after the manner of adulterers, and after the manner of women that shed blood, because they are adulterers, and the blood is in their hand. For thus saith the Lord God, I will bring up a company upon them, and give them to be removed and spoiled. I would say that the wealthy common people are taking over the poor common people. Don't you? Common in the word of God is 21 times. So we can see it as people. I would say there is common Jews and common Gentiles. Common is a place you will, you will not see the wealthy. The wealthy people that are poor. Okay, let's start this one up. Common is a place you will not see the wealthy people. They are poor. See it more than we are willing to go. Matthew 27. 27. Then the soldiers of the governor took Jesus into a common hall and gathered unto him the whole band of soldiers. We see Jesus went into a common hall. We call that jail today. Jesus even talked to the common people. Mark 12. And 35. Down to 37. And Jesus answered and said, While well, he taught in the temple, How say the sacrifice scribes that Christ is the son of David? 
For David himself said, By the Holy Ghost, the Lord said to my Lord, Sit thou on my right hand, till I make thy enemies thy footstool. David therefore himself called him Lord, and hence is he then his son, and the common people heard him gladly. And he is today, so do you hear his voice? It is in the KJV, saying, I love you. Read my love letter. We all have to have things in common, like food, clothes, and places to sleep, etc. And we need to give what we have to the ones that don't have, especially if we believe in Jesus Christ. Acts 2, 44. <clears throat> Acts 2, we want 44 down to 45. And all that believe were together, and, and all things common. And so their possession and good and parted them to all men as everyone had needed. Do we see ourselves as equally or are you better than me? We should look at each other as the same. Acts 4, 32. And the multitude of them that believed were of one heart and of one soul. Neither said any of them aught of the things which, we, which he possessed was his own, but they had all things in common. You see, we do have a people who do think they are better than us common people, and they will not go to a jail at all but will put us there who believe in Christ Jesus acts 5 17 and 18 then the high priest rose up and all they that were with him which in the select of the Sadducees and were fill, filled with indignation and laid their hands on the apostles and put them in a common prison <clears throat> common is people and a place. Now we have food. Acts 10 and 15. And the voice spoke unto him again the second time. What God hath cleansed, that shall that call not thou common. Okay. See, common is people and places. Now we have, okay, I already read that. But if you read it in a whole, you will see it is not talking about food. It is the Gentiles. Uh, us, you and me, Acts 10 and 28. And he said unto them, you know how that it is an unlawful thing for a man that is a Jew to keep company or come unto one of another nation. But God has showed me that I should not call any man common or unclean. <clears throat> we are all common with sin. Um, Sorry, I lost my place. <laughs> the way Creator God, Jesus, sees it is we are all the same. We have the same blood of Christ on us, and we are cleansed. Acts 11, 7 through 10. And I heard a voice saying unto me, Arise, Peter, slay and eat. But I said, Not so, Lord, for nothing common or unclean hath at any time entered into my mouth. But the voice answered me again from heaven, What God has cleansed, that call, thou not, thou, call not thou common. And this was done three times, and all were drawn up again into heaven. We are all common with sin, but now we can... We can overcome temptation that is common to man, all men, 
and faith is common to all, all the elect of Christ. Titus 1. And we want 1 through 4. Paul, a servant of God, an apostle of Jesus Christ, according to the faith of God's elect, and the acknowledging of the truth, which is after godliness, in hope of eternal life, which God, that cannot lie, promised before the world began, but hath in due time manifest his word through preaching, which is commended unto me, according to the commandment of God our Savior. To Titus, my own son, after the common faith, grace, mercy, and peace from God the Father and the Lord Jesus Christ, our Savior. Faith, grace, mercy, peace are now common to the elect of Christ Jesus. Salvation is commonly written for all to read and understand, and it is delivered to you, okay, in the Strong's, it is 2839, the New Testament, shared by all, several, profane, common, defiled, unclean, and holy. Now, let's look at the heart of the Hebrew history, and we want page 320. I gotta find where it was. <laughs> okay. Antithesis died in a loathsome disease while breathing out threats of slaughter against his enemy. Okay, that wouldn't be it. During the period which are concerning the Pharisees and the Sadducees, enraged as the two strongest religion parted of the Jews. So the Jews only had the two types of religion. They are opposed to each other at almost every point, and the rival between them was keen and often very bitter. The uh, patriots which stood by Judas, Machibus, desired religious freedom and were willing to die for it. They were known at first as the Hasims, and as soon as religious freedom was won, they stopped fighting since they had no political ambitions. Out of this group came the Pharisees. The word means separated, and is usually interpreted as meaning separation from unclean things and persons. Gra uh, gradually, they came to be regarded as a conservative who held steadfast to the laws of Moses and the traditions of the fathers. They represent common people, and especially in New Testament times, where the majority party were very influential. Influential. I can't pronounce that. So, as we can see, the Jews don't think they are common. They think they are better than we are. So, that's it on this one. And I'm sorry I messed up so much, but I've got to get used to this, and I've got to get into it, because I do miss it. I might make mistakes, but God is with us. I love you guys. Bye.